and thus we are at the gate to Hallowfall. Where we must go speak with Anduin. Hi, Kitek, how are you? Working from home day, has the expansion? Amazing, incredible, loving our life. There's a pet we need to capture. I must not get distracted. And there's a weathered tome, there's a oh, lore object. It shines as brightly as the sun. There's so many things. So many things everywhere. Are those airships? Whoa! We're underground. Whoa. Wait. Dude. What can I do? We'll find out if the people of Hallowfall will stand with us as allies, bestie. Well, I hear the Radiant Song? Is it coming from that crystal? And we know. Uh, wait, is it? Is that a body? That's a straight up body. What should one do in his last moments if not praising the light of our grand empire and the light of our emperor? Approaching my last breath, I, Elvain, a paladin and a bringer of the light to darkened sights, will write my own eulogy. I spread the light of uh, Belladar through these light-forsaken creeks and chasms. I bring the light to take a stand and banish the darkness. With my life, I have vowed to complete this task, and it is with my death that I have expanded the Arathi's reach. We are seekers of light. We are the holders of the eternal brazier of our empire. The flame's light guides us wherever we stride. We are the stars that guide through the never-ending light. My life for the empire. My life for the emperor. My life for the empire. <laughs> wow, that's deep. And it also resonates a lot more because I am in fact a paladin, a human paladin as well. So that's interesting. Okay, let's follow Anduin down here. Let's see where this see where his brother's going oh 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 it's pretty oh oh hold on the Nerubians breached the Aegis wall Farron the darkness forced us back is it Aegis 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 the dark will kill us all general we'll never survive unless quiet lamplighter Outsiders are here. Who are you? <laughs> um. <gasps> Farin! Cannot hide from evil. If you are lost, yo, us, we are here to help. I will see you through. The Farin was in the the teaser, right? Oh, that render was sick. Hallowfall has to be one of my favorite zones. I just got there this morning as well. Yeah, let's go! Friendly outsiders are not common in Hallowfall. Only enemies emerging from the shadow, but you seem comfortable in the light despite how unusual you may appear. I would welcome you were we not in the midst of a crisis. That's what we're here to help! Don't give in to fear. Many in Hallowfall will call you outsider. I would call you friend. I would also ask for your help. If you're no stranger to combat, <laughs> I am, in fact, a tankadin. What's up? Desperate times forge strong friendships. General Steelstrike ordered an army to fall back from the Nerubian onslaught. In doing so, she abandoned a lamplighter and many troops to the darkness. I may not be able to save them on my own, but with your help, I may succeed. If you're willing, ride with me to meet me there. I love how it, she, like, she just like turns around and like, you look like you can kill some dudes. Let's go. Desperate times. Desperate times. Be strong, my friend. I'm Farin, Lamplighter of Hallowfall. I have a relief cart prepped for the wall. Will you join me? Sure. Anduin, I'm an adventurer exploring Kazalgar with my friend. An adventurer exploring Kazalgar with my friend. Sure. Sure, let's go with that. 100%. I mean, yeah, I get accurate, I suppose. 
right in the cut. That crystal. Star. We call it a star. Belladar, the Emperor's vision of holy light. A vision of light. Deep under the ground. We're the Halofall expedition of the Arathi Empire. We followed our Emperor's sacred oh, vision of That's a treasure. To fight Everyone make a mental note. The final battle between light and dark. As we cross the sea. There's another one. In a storm. Everyone make a mental the note. It was uh, enveloped in golden radiance. I mean, I'm paying attention. I'm paying attention. Flash, our entire armada was transported down here. You've been down here fighting the Norubians ever since? Well, they just disappeared into this place. Child. The only child when we were marooned. The Nerubians have never ceased their hostility. They crawl up from their kingdom seeking a fight and try to drag us down into the darkness. Steel Strike's army does well beneath Belladar's light. Those bugs are good at extinguishing hope. We lamplighters have trained to charge into the darkness. We save those who are lost and keep the dawn towers lit. Her voice sounds really familiar. We're here. Great Chiron! You're alive! Farron, your courage equips you well, young lamplighter. What's up with this? What's up with the defender of the wall? You okay? What's, go what's going on here? Uh, it's not coming up for some reason. I will find it eventually. Anyway, continuing on. Outsider. Oh, let's go. United Nations diplomacy. <laughs> we just keep farming these rep achievements, apparently. The Nerubians took us by surprise. The army went into retreat when the wall was breached. I've been keeping them away from this tower, but I could certainly use your help. In service to others, we find A lamplighter will always accept an ally, bestie. Huge. Those lost to the it's darkness. good to have new allies here. Together we have much better chances of protecting this tower. The Nerubians have overwhelmed us. If we're going to have a chance against them, we need to destroy the burrows they're using to come under the wall. If you can handle that, we will survey the field from the top of the wall and meet you there. Search the shadows. Got it. Lead them home. Guild rep achieves a bug and keeps spamming. Yeah, they my do. Faith <laughs> my hope. It's hard to see the destruction here, knowing how well the wall served us for so long. Hard to think about the soldiers who died defending it and those that will die because we don't have the defensive advantage. Despite everything. One dawn tower has fallen, but a faint glimmer of hope remains with the smaller key flame atop the wall. The shattered remnants needed to sustain that light were taken by the Nerubians. Gather the remnants from the Nerubians you slay and help ignite a beacon of hope. A beacon? The dawn tower won't be enough to hold them back. The Nerubians have gotten braver. We must ignite the key flame on the wall. Its sacred flame will keep the Nerubians at bay. Okay. Oh, okay. Destroy. Ooh. Yo, this music sounds like Game of Thrones. Game of Thrones vibes. Oh, I think they changed the scaling today as well. So some stuff might be a little bit harder to kill now. We're going to have to get some gear. Pew, pew. Oh, 
shattered remnants. I'm only getting 194 XP because I've been leveling up so much from doing uh, the Dragonflight meta achievement. Oh, these aren't supposed to be crabs, are they? They're supposed to be Nerubians. <laughs> I keep forgetting. I need to turn that off to get like the full war within experience, especially because we're getting closer to Ashkahet. Like, I don't know, it feels weird and wrong. They don't even actually look like spiders to me. This is the crab expansion, yeah. Yep. Okay, turn that off. <laughs> I think we have to reload. Oh no, that was, it instantly swapped them out. Cool. Yeah, this looks more like what it is supposed to be to me. I need to make this... Oh, it is four. Okay, I'll move that. Oh man, the music is something else. Definitely. Like this bit right here. The heavy-hearted War Within vibe. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I do like how um, how shiny the buttons are now. Like it's really satisfying to press them. I kind of wish you could reduce the border a little bit. Like it's a little, it's a little much. It could be a little much. Don't web wrap me, mate. I must... I must have it. Oi! Rude. I'm just out here trying to mine. Oh God, my DPS is awful now. Is that Missledyne? Just got War Within Pathfinder. Huge. <laughs> Basically beef? Is that what I just looted? Yeah. Amazing. <laughs> Aegis Key Flame Empowered. The beacons are lit! Gondor calls for aid! The sacred flame illuminates our path. We venture Excellent, Bestie. If we don't have to worry about the Nerubians stabbing us in the back, we can deal with those pouring through below. We must confront Wonderful. We are a light in the darkness. We carry the flame into the unknown. In my heart, I wish to continue discussing. A lamplighter brings hope. Good people died here today, Bestie. A lot of them. Every Arathi soldier carries a tinderbox. It represents their devotion to the sacred flame. Many use it as a focus to bring forth the flame's light. In the dark places beyond the light of Belladar, the sacred flame brings hope. 
With the Nerubian attack, we can't recover their bodies, so we must retrieve these symbols to venerate their sacrifice, then use this torch to burn their bodies. It's best, uh, it's the best funeral we can offer. We are are consecrated in the sacred flame. Do not leave my people on the field. I am eager to hear your story. Bestie, if we don't stem the tide of Nerubians climbing up to us, nothing else will matter. Their numbers are just too great. We need to delay their onslaught to buy people of Hello full time to prepare. The war still serves as a very effective choke point. Do what you can to thin their numbers. Kill dudes, burn bodies, loot tinderboxes. Gotcha! Understood. This is me understanding the assignment. And making sure that I press buttons because I have abilities that I can use these days. Oh, you can loot. You can loot the body and uh, and burn the body at the same time. That's amazing. Oh, there's a rare down there. Hurry up and die. I have to go kill the rare. Come, 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 come. I'm, I must go check it out. I got you, friend. Yo. Look at us. You know what? This one needs to be gear because my mouse is always my mouse is always up here. Equipment, consumables, and profession goods. Oh, and some leather shoulders, <laughs> and a swarming egg sack. Love that for us. Huge upgrade. Chuck those bad boys on. Oh, my DPS feels awful. It's like, yeah, I can live through anything, but like, it takes four years to kill anything. The sacred flame guides me. We keep the dawn towers. This lit. is a good start. There are still many more Nerubians coming from below. We must confront the darkness. Ooh. Scaling catching up. Yeah. Yeah. Falls, Thank you, Bestie. You've helped to honor their sacrifice as best as we can. Holding onto hope in the very heart of shadow. They seek the light of the sacred flame now. Come, their killers still live. My Don't crafted boots are actually fear. better still. It's critical with so many Nerubians pouring through the Aegis Wall uh, that we defend our airships docked at Tenir's Ascent. The Nerubians have always outnumbered us, but our fleet allow us. Our fleet allows us to concentrate our, defend, uh, our defenders where they're attacking, as well as allowing us to bombard them from the safety of the skies. If we lose our armada, our hopes fade dramatically. Meet us there when you can. Okay. Look, those Nerubians are fleeing. Ugh. Not fleeing, advancing. They mean to destroy our air docks. I can't see any air dock, and I feel, <laughs> I feel like if I played this, I'm gonna have to do a heckin' reaction stream of when I finally log into the War Within on my computer when I get home next week, like next Wednesday, <laughs> because I'm gonna like log in and it'll be like seeing with glasses on for the first time. There'll be all these things that I could, I've never seen before. Oh wow, so far away. A Tenny's descent aboard the Dawnbreaker. Okay. The visual's gonna blow your socks off. I'm on the minimum settings right now because I'm on a laptop while I'm traveling. Oh, 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 wow. Wow, we. Look at this airship. Holy. Oh, I got shivers. 
Um, yeah, I'm on minimal settings because I'm on a laptop, so I can't imagine what it's going to be like when I jump on my my gaming computer for like the first time in three months. My Voker is carrying a staff with a lamp on the end. He runs, it lights up the ground like a lantern would. Oh, that's so cute. Yeah, my brain's going to explode. We owe our service I'm glad you're with us, bestie. I forgot that you were still traveling. Yeah, I leave on Tuesday night. I leave to come home on Tuesday night. Soon, soon. I'm glad you're with us, bestie. Without our airships, we have little chance of holding back the Nerubians in the long run. To say nothing of our dock workers who are safe below the dock, let's see to their defense. If you are lost in darkness, bestie, are if we're going to hold the Nerubians back, we have to deal with their siege weapons. Around Tunis Ascent, there are kegs of black powder to supply our ships for combat. Since the Nerubians have caught up these, uh, have caught these ships on the ground, let's put that powder to work. Gather some barrels, take them down to the Nerubian siege weapons. I got you. We, keep the dawn towers we fought the Nerubians since we arrived, bestie. They love calling me by my name. Their attacks have not risen to this level in a long time. These airship docks are clearly a target, but do they have any others? Is there a larger goal? The Nerubians carry shade casters with orders from their queen. We need to learn what we can from their plans and intentions. And discovering a few of those shade casters is the best way we can do so. The Dawn Tower isn't lit. If Beladar should shift. You're right. Your new friends can protect the people. We must ignite the sacred flame. If Beladar should shift. It's interesting the way that they refer to it. <gasps> There's another rare. Hold the phone. Eh. Eh, Lemmy. Where is it? Here it is. 77. It's fine. Ix lord the spinner. Wait, why did the music just get all lighthearted and, and shit? It's like Disney Dreamlight vibes again, but like I'm here for it. Like it, give, it fills me with like hope and like, oh, we're farming and we're going to go to the market and... Do you know what I mean? Like, oh, it's beautiful. It's just like it's just Disney vibes, you know. Like I'm, I'm here for it. It's gorgeous. Oh, there's another one. There's another rare up here. Taskmaster. Oh my god, he's level 80. <gasps> help. 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 Some somebody. Somebody. Any anyone? Anyone in the area with a minimap turned on? Please. I beg. Oh my god. It's fine, I got this. Yes, friend, help. <laughs> Panic. There's a treasure up here too. Bless this little hunterino. Yeah, commendation. I'm guessing we need Hello Fall commendations for reasons. So compared to heroics, where are delves at? I'm guessing like you do a couple of delves, you do some dungeons, you go back, you do some higher delves, and then the top level delve gives you heroic level gear, right? As far as heroic raid gear. Oh, so you would probably want to be doing like dungeons and raids and stuff um, concurrently with delves to like unlock. Interesting. Okay. Wait, what's that? Oh, Queen of... Ugh. 
The queen is speaking. You sense a nearby sky riding glyph. glyph. Don't see it, but I'm sure. Oh, it's probably up here. Or something. Nope. That's just the light in general. It's going to be fun in this area. The level should unlock when season one starts. Yeah, and we have to, um, I noticed that there's a feat of strength for season one. So I want to be a good grill and actually try to like keep up with that stuff this time would be ideal. That's why I'm focusing on just the campaign to unlock most things if I can. Um, and then, uh, and like, I'm going to be level 80 relatively quickly um and then i can slowly do like all the side quests and stuff on my alts and slowly get those sorted as well i'm being practical while also allowing myself to like enjoy things you know like i'm usually the hyper productive one that has to Oh boy. That is terrifying. I'm usually one to like blast through content and be like, I must get level 80. I must do all the things. I got to do it really fast. And this time I'm just like, dude, I want to like take it in. Like, I don't want to play no beta. I don't want, I don't want no spoilers. I don't want like, I mean, like, spoilers, it's like, yeah, you, you kind of see some stuff, you know what I mean? But, like, yeah. I'd love to have a few people to do delves with. Oh, yo, that would be awesome. I keep forgetting that it's not, like, completely single player. Like, you can do group delves. I'm totally down for that. 100%. Like, get those achieves, like, with, with friends, you know? Final War? Ascension? Not as many answers as questions, Bestie, but we at least have some pieces of the puzzle. We have lost so many. Were you able to destroy their siege weapons? I he was. was. With these siege weapons destroyed, we're in much better shape. Faerun went ahead to the light of the uh, Dawn Tower with Great Chiron. Um, she asked that we meet him, meet them there. Will I be forgiven? Bestie, the Nerubians all seem to be taking orders from that siege lord south of here. If we can defeat her, that may turn the tide of this attack. Without a leader organizing the attack, the Arathi may be able to drive back the Nerubians, especially if Faerun is able to light this uh, dawn tower she spoke of. But the longer we delay, the greater damage to the Arathi airships. Go quickly. I hear a radiant song. Yeah, um, I, uh, I, well, I think they, um, they increased... God damn it. I think they increased the friend limit, but also if anyone needs a guild, apparently they are cross realm and cross faction now. So, and I am, I am pretty sure I have permission to be able to invite. Well, uh, so I don't know if Beckwith is in this guild, but the other guys that we play with, with him, are in this guild as well. So it's getting a little bit more active now with more people like adding, inviting their alts and stuff, like Kelly Cags and that are in this guild. Um, and yeah, they're all like a bunch of cool, bunch of cool chill dudes, um, but they usually do a uh, pretty, like they can, they have alts as well, but they do like a range of content, same as me, so. So yeah, feel free to add, feel free to join the uh, the guild if you want to. Just let me know if you want an invite. If people end up being dicks, we'll just kick them anyway. So it's like whatever, you know. I will help. Oh, Elyria, wait, where did you come from? Was she already fighting the thing? We were talking, we got distracted. With an Arubian leader defeated, we should be able to leave the defenses to the Arathi. You've saved many lives today, Bestie. I thought we agreed you'd stay in Dornagal. Mm. I heard stories of the Arathi as king. I mean, I was curious. As 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 king, as king, huh? About that. 
How, how's that going for you? We have lost so I'm in a random guild at the moment. We'll probably drop it. Yeah, fair. I, I don't like the random guild vibe. Like, I would rather be in no guild than random guild. Um, so, yeah. It, I am definitely committed to playing this expansion. I've not been so excited about one in a long time. And I'm being a lot... I'm giving myself a lot more grace to, like... If I feel that I'm getting bored with something, it's like I'm giving myself grace to be able to go and do something else within the game. So like, I'll probably like not be pushing crazy hard, but yeah, having a good time, having a good chill time. And you sound like you play the same, so yeah. Um, Bestie, Feyren went to light the dawn tower. Yeah, you said that. Yeah, you said that. It's hard to imagine that any beacon could outshine their star Belladar, but I am eager to see this new expression of the light. Meet me at the dawn by the Dawn Tower and we can see how the sacred flame of the Arathi helps to safeguard those long-lost cousins of mine. I hear a radiant song. Let us, let us run! At the end of Dragonflight, yeah. Yep, yep. I will not, no. I'm not doing pet battles. I'm doing the campaign. We can do pet battles during side quests. Am I needed? I'm ready. Oh. It's Belladar, a star. It shifts between the light and this. Ugh. The Dawn Towers hold back the darkness with the sacred flame. But the light always... That's what returns. they meant. Well, he's doing his best, mate. He's he's seen some stuff. The stars are devoured. Mm. And they light a candle. You know how this ends, Illyria. Hold please, In mommy is speaking. The void consumes <gasps> everything. Show yourself, monster! <laughs> you know. Something makes me really wish, disgustingly so, that there was spatial audio when she talks to me like that. Be careful, Lyria. It's the only ASMR that I would sign up for. Theron, watch the, the only outsiders. one. It's dangerous to travel alone. It'd be so good. Tell me about it. A lamplighter brings hope. A beacon in the dark. The yes, when like when she came up to Alaria's ear, I was expecting it to like just hit me on one side, and it didn't. And I was like, oh, I kind of wish it did though. I don't know if maybe they did do that, and it's just my sound settings don't have that. But oh my god, it would be so good. Darkness has fallen. We can't rest yet. The light from the tower will hold the worst dangers in the darkness at bay. It's my duty as a lamplighter to keep all the towers blazing. My patrol takes me to Laurel's Crossing by air next. I would welcome you and Anduin at my side for all our sakes. If you are lost in darkness. This all right, let's do it. Darkness. How long does it last? <laughs> Hi, Seamus. Um, Zalatath's voice. Because so Zalatath was whispering in Alaria's ear. Oh, look at the tiny little air taxi. The little skiff. Oh my god, it's so cute. Are they going to jump in? No, they're waiting for me to jump in. Yeah! 
Let's get in the gondola, my lovelies. To live under constant threat of shadow. How do you do it? When night falls, the army enacts the shadow curfew. Get inside, get Shadow to curfew. Oh, oh no. Oh, Incoming. oh, oh no. On those enemies. I'm so glad I changed my buttons yesterday. Oh boy, am I glad I changed my buttons. Ugh, Kelly Gags, we were just talking about you. Your ears must have been burning. Welcome, Raiders. Some find their faith shaken. Yeah, this time I'ma let it all come out. This time I'ma, oh God, there's more. My way or the highway. Y'all are pumping heroics right now. Wait, what is this giant fucking Cthulhu, Sky Cthulhu shit? Take out a warship, you know shit. Ourselves and in each other if we are to succeed. I finally made it to Hello Fall. I'm still only doing the campaign. Anduin stares mournfully up at the dark star. Greetings, outsider. Oh, I forgot to get the flight Greetings. path earlier. <laughs> Farron, thank the flame. Kovis are raiding Sinner's yearning. The army went ahead, but Say no more. Our new allies and I will go to their aid. Seek shelter immediately. Okay. He's gonna take his shovel and he's going. This this is this experience must be immersive. Let's go, boys. Aluria acts a lot like Sylvanas with her hyperfixation on catching Zalatath. I mean, runs in the family, doesn't it? Have I run too far? Oh no, they just, they just, they just yeet. They just went. <laughs> they just darn went. Okay, let's jump on the mount. Oh, dude, so cool. All these areas are so cool. I kind of want to follow the path like we used to have to back in the old school days of not being able to dragon ride. Secure the village, then rescue the captives. They'll be dead by then. Oh, it's Steel Strike again. She's a bit of a... <laughs> hey, Sai, what's up? How are you? Happy close to weekend. I hope everyone in Cali's stream enjoyed. Uh, I'm guessing that everyone was like farming heroics and stuff. I'm a bit of a ways off, but we'll get there. I don't care if Steel Strike thinks I'm reckless. I don't care if I get hurt. I can't let my people die. We've lost too many already. To Nerubians, to Cobius, uh, to the Shadows themselves. There's hardly any of us left. How long until there are none? Ask for more information about the Cobus. Horrible, violent, and stinky creatures. They've plagued us since the moment we arrived in Hellofall. We've tried to figure out how intelligent they are could we parlay for peace? But every scholar we've sent to study how to communicate with them has ended up dead, usually dead and eaten. And worse, they seem to wield some kind of necromancy. As if eating us wasn't enough, sometimes they chose to dishonor the memory of our allies even further by raising them to fight against us. I have no idea how they, cho uh, how they choose which of us to eat and which of us to praise. Raise the strongest, eat the plumpest? It churns my stomach to contemplate these things. Mm. Despite everything, the Cobus have already been dragging the innocent villagers to the shore. They'll drown them and eat them. We have to save them. Be strong, oh, grats! I don't care if Steel Strike thinks I'm reckless. I don't care if I get hurt. I can't let my people die. We've lost too many already. To Nerubians, to Cobus, to the Shadows themselves. There's hardly any of us left. Cobus lurk in the shallows of murky water and snatch up any who come near faster than a viper. And that's just when they hunt alone. In numbers, they swarm, they're swarm. a swarm to be reckoned with. They've been a plague on our outskirt villages since the day we arrived. They eat victims alive, given the chance. We must rescue the villagers and uh, have the rescue, rescue the villagers that have already been dragged to the water. 
Alrighty. Into the unknown. Judging by the glint in your eye, you wish to join Faerun in this madness. To push into the to push into the Cobus waters in the darkness, you are a fool with a death wish. Take as many of those damnable fish out as you can before they drag you into the depths for their dinner. <laughs> we must rely on outsiders to All save right. soldiers with me. Oh god. I'm more fighter than healer. Anduin, can you Yes, he can. Not with the light. But I know first aid. He still lost his connection to the light. Not with the light, but I know first aid. Brother, I'm a paladin. Let me let me let me flash of light. This please. Dude, really? I will what do you mean? Okay. Be forgiven. Oh God. Panic. <laughs> there are others to save. Hurry! And don't need a holy jumper cable. <laughs> yeah. I was actually thinking just now. Uh, I might do. Oh, there's another rare over here. What level is it? Seventy-seven. Um, I was thinking, actually, maybe I will do <laughs> Andrew and the Taylor creating bandages. Yeah. Um, I was thinking maybe actually I'll do all of the like I'll finish the campaign and then I'll do the side quests. Then I'll switch to war mode and I'll do all the side quests and everything else that I need to do in war mode. Like, unless there's a specific world quest that I have to do that's like really difficult to do in war mode or something. Um, I might do that. Like, it's annoying having being so being interrupted a lot, like while you're trying to do the story or whatever. Um, but I think that might be. I think that might be fun. I also likewise would like this, please. Yeah, weeping bismuth. The black blood of the old gods has begun to pull beneath Kazalgar, and its festering presence has even had an effect on the precious metals it touches. Miners who brave the darkest depths to gather from these deposits will experience agony, the likes of which mortals were not meant to endure. Fortunately, survivors will recover some writhing samples for their efforts. Oh. <laughs> well. Excellent. Went hard on the side quest early, which is how I got to 80 at the start of Hello Fall. Just focus on campaign. Yeah, uh, I'm saving the side quest to level alts. Since we have war bands now, um, I figured I'm just going to finish the campaign on this character so I can unlock world quests and stuff. And then on my alts, I'll like use the side quest to level uh, and get some gear and whatnot. I think that's a good way to like share the love and actually play some alts for once, which is going to be, which is part of what makes this expansion so much more exciting for me right now, honestly. Um, like I really struggled to find a purpose to play any other character in Dragonflight. Um, or like any other expansion, it was kind of like, this is my main, and that is what I play. Uh, but now I kind of want to, like, I want to play more characters. It makes me excited to think that, like, oh, I can, I can have a PvP character now. I can have a character who's a healer that I'm comfortable, because I don't enjoy, um, I used to be a Holy Pally main back in vanilla and BC. Um, and I don't actually enjoy the way that Holy Pally plays now. Uh, like, I, I don't know. I just feel like I can't work it out. But if there's another class that I enjoy healing on, then I'm excited to, like, you know, level that character and specifically do dungeons or raids on the healer or, like, you know, tank on this character. Um have a druid that I gather stuff with, like, you know, like, I'm excited that I actually have the opportunity to do that now. I can't attack 
So yay for us. Ooh, gasping plea. A gasping, pathetic-looking fish taken from the corpse of a cobus flops weakly in your hand. Its beady eye twitches and you suddenly hear a breathless voice in the recesses of your mind. The water. Take me to the water. Away from these cobus wretches. Away from the sky. Put the strange fish in safe waters near the cobus camp at the Sunless Strand. I got you, bud. Right over here, hey? Where it's safe? No? Not safe enough? Oh, right here. Right here. I see it. Oh, it's an action button. Of course it is. The fish gulps down seawater to regain its breath and then turns to look at you with intelligent eyes. I live thanks to you. The shade of these rocks suits me per so it suits me nicely for the work to be done. Allow me to repay your selfless gesture. What work? Oh, and now he has side quests. We're going to leave him there. Wait, I wonder if he's going to be available on my alts. What do y'all reckon? Like, is he now unlocked for any of my alt characters to interact with? This is the stuff that makes me wonder. There's a treasure over here. Ooh. No, it's not my preferred armored type, but... You trinket? New waist, new hands. Nice. Bonus objective. Might as well, while we're in the area. Um, but yeah, hmm, interesting. I might make a note on my map just in case. I like the idea that the fish is actually what's left of Nazoth. Oh god, and we have to help it? Ew. Brother, ew. <laughs> Look at all his XP! Yeah. Um, okay. Yeah. Pen and new. Um, fish side quests. Low level quests show on continent map. Just in case. Where's your. Help the fish boy. Yeah. Exactly. For a second he took no damage and I was like, oh my gosh, is this dude? Is there a shortcut for, um, like, main hand weapon in macros? Like, can I make a macro for... Can I make a macro for this, like, applying the thingo to my weapon? Rite of Sanctification? I feel like that has to be macroable because it's the most annoying thing to have to, like, update. There it is. Oh, that would be amazing if anyone... Thank you. Big appreciate. What can I do? You have our thanks, Farron Lothar. 
And you too, outsiders. Faerun Lothar. Lothar! Lothar. Hold. Hold, please. Thank you, bestie. These people are badly hurt, but I think they will make it. Some seem to have some skill in healing of their own. We have lost so many. We cannot hide from evil. I don't care if Steel Strike thinks I'm right. Oh, yeah. Don't give in to fear. Oh, hang on. We are a light about the Cobras? The okay. I trust in your strength. I must ask you to go ahead to reinforce Sinner's yearning. Anduin and I can see my people to safety in Laurel's Crossing. With the darkness and the Cobras, the hearts of my people are in Sinner's yearning. We'll be faltering to fear. Uh, we can't let them wallow. Light a torch with the sacred flame in the center of town and use it to inspire my people's valor. Remind them of our strength. Or their strength. We will catch up with you. May the flame guide you, my friend. In my heart, what if I just stand in the middle of the thing and just use consecration to... several times? My leg. I can't. Oh. There is all... Easy. We'll patch you up. Friend, go assist the general. I'm healing. Let me do the heal. Like literally, my consecration heals. Let me use it. Did I hear that right earlier? You're a uh, Lothal. Mm-hmm. You know the name? Mm-hmm. I was named for Anduin Lothar, one of Stormwind's greatest heroes. He was close friends with my grandfather, King Lane Rin. Few names hold higher esteem. You must be a lady, or. A oh no! Don't you start using formalities on me. My family is noble, but it's been long since we've seen great fortune. To think I had relatives in the old world. Wonderful. I hope I can live up to such legends. <laughs> Wait, if your grandfather was king of this Stormwind, then Anduin, my new friend. Are you Are a you king? <gasps> Not anymore. Sir, please. Don't you start using formalities on me. Oh, man. I, I love these little vignettes. They're so great. It's so funny because last time I was playing, someone ran up to me and they're like, oh, my God, don't stay a while and listen. The RP takes forever. And I was like, dude, it's there for a reason. So you live. I am so excited. I've never been more excited. To, but do you know why? Because I didn't go out of my way to like get all the information like hi nick welcome i love los angeles i know wait so who's who's in charge of stormwind right now i can, i feel like i i so i still haven't finished shadowlands i still need to like um go back and and like see what's up over there and do all the things. I I still never finished that expansion. Um, so I'm not sure I even fully understand what's going on back over there. I must ensure my people survive. Oh, again. Oh, really? But he's not like king. He's just kind of like standing in. More like a council. Yeah, right, 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 right. Hmm. Mm. So you outsiders and Farron managed to both survive and save villagers at the beach. We're in trouble here. The Cobus brought some of their strongest forces to the doorsteps of villagers. Uh, we have our hands full just holding the line. Take out these monsters. I love how every time. Light the torch. I love how every time I talk to her, she's like, kill, kill, kill. Slay everything. <laughs> oh, Teralian is king. Yeah. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. Yeah. King Teralian. Yes, yes. I remember. Yep. I do need a lot of, like, refreshing... But, it, but the thing is that just, like, watching YouTube videos doesn't quite, like, sit in my brain. Like, I need to do what I'm doing here and, like, actually replay the campaign and, like, fully understand what's going on. More like a steward. 
I guess if you if you mean like he is uh, like the leader of Stormwind currently, I guess. Who? What's going on here then? Oh, the sacred flame! Oh, deep slugger slime. Oh, there's a thing that spawns here and that we need to kill. Got it. Acting king, yeah. Acting general manager of Stormwind. <laughs> Oh, he's plague stomping me. Interim CEO <laughs> of Stormwind. Yep. Yep. So should I actually be spamming this? Will the light to coalesce and become manifest a holy armament wielded by your target while wielding a sacred weapon your spells and abilities have a chance to blah 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 becomes holy bulwark after use i need to read what holy bulwark does prime minister <laughs> duty manager Terrellian. gin Greymane, vice president of the alliance <laughs> oh my god yeah correct on all fronts i love it I love how it's like just trying to work out what's going on. Now let me rally. Let me rally the boys. There we go. Got him. I'm sure Trillian has come into play in the saga at some point given his connection to the armies of the light. Um he did. Wasn't he wasn't he in classic as well a lot? Like in Plaguelands or something. Um, and also, like maybe BFA and or Shadowlands or something like that. Probably Legion as well. Legion, yeah. I remember him being like. Found him in Legion when we went to Draenor. Yeah. Tide Lord. Ah, I sense a nearby glyph. Ah, there it is. Just look up. Okay, Holy Bulwark. Will the light to coalesce manifest a holy armament? Uh, while wielding Holy Bullet, gain an absorption, absorption shield of your max health. Oh, so I don't necessarily... It doesn't make sense to spam it then. I don't know. I don't know what these glyphs give me now, because I don't know what else we can upgrade, but I'll pick them up anyway, I suppose. Ain't no one in here. Never mind. Anyone need some rallying? There we go. Done. Oh, there's more. Stay a while and listen. Now stop and take a breath from us. I will help if I can. Just kidding. The shadows are unsettling. Who is calling for help? Uh, every Arathi has killed more Cobus than I care to count. We've also lost more Arathi to Cobus than I want to count. Oh, yeah, 100%. I don't know what underwater cavern they hail from, but I shudder to think of it. Our holy mission takes a toll. I don't care if still strike thinks I'm reckless. Yeah, 100%. The Arathi is strong, proud. The Cobus may be vile, but they will not win this day. Choose your reward. Oh, but what if I want both? 
Oh, we can get an unlit torch or we can get a lit torch. Why would you ever choose the unlit one? Can't we just have both? Can't we just have an un... Whoa. 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 I was too busy looking at my inventory. I didn't even get to witness that. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, Xander, what's up? What just happened? Did you see that shadow and the oil well? It's gone dark? I've never seen anything like this before. Could it be a nearby Dawn Tower? Hurry! Okay. Those shadows came from the Dawn Tower. Baron, wait! We must withdraw to Merelda! Oop. Nope. She's already gone. Oh, Steel Strike. You can't control her. When will you learn? Buddy. Wait, which tower? Which tower are we looking at? This one? This This tower? We owe our service to those in need. We care the Dawn Tower. What is happening to it? has whispered to me of your arrival and your failure at Dalaran. Where is your master? <laughs> oh! Yeah, a lot of them are. No. Brilliant. The sacred flame! What has Alric and his cults done? I won't lie, a lot of the dudes just kind of like sound the same. <laughs> they claim allegiance to Zalatath, and so their lives are forfeit. My arrows strike true. The fear and shame of these people lingers in the air like a fog. I will not fail ahead. Her portrait is not the vibe though. Anyway, I digress. Dude sounds like Nathanos and the Raven Lord. Uh, do a Google. Do a Google for us, mate. Let us know what you find. I would also love to know who plays Feyre and Lothar. Um, so if anyone can find that information, I would love that. Thank you in advance. Um, this Order of the Night, as they call themselves, did some foul ritual to turn the tower's flame into darkness. I know not to what. We should investigate. They will not escape. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We should. The flame is corrupted. Can we restore it? I'm a paladin. I can do anything. Just let me. Just let me do the work, mate. This shadow. It's too much. Anduin, help her. Call upon the light once more. I... Oh, come on, man. No, I can't. There must be another way. Yes, you can. He's so damaged, dude. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. Oh, there's a downstairs. With candles. And a dead guy. But no clues. And we can't go upstairs. There's a ladder that goes nowhere. Oh. This dead body is a clue, in fact. The wounds on the body form a ritualistic pattern. This poor soul was not only killed, but sacrificed to the darkness. I wish his spirit well. <laughs> My friends, we have lived in fear long enough. Belladar has been trying to show us the way. 
The light has forsaken us. In the light's glare, all are watched, exposed. In the darkness, we are free. We are afraid of the dark only because the light wants us to be. Belladar has shown us the way. No more fear. Instead, we must become fear. Alric lead. The journal is heavily scratched out and torn up. Few segments remain. Tabitha, I am leaving. I'm tired. I don't expect you to understand. The Order of Night gathers strength. They hide in caves, in towns, and linger with our greatest enemies. They even have a base beneath one of their precious towers. The army has no idea. The light has made us all blind. Not me. Not anymore. What have we fought for this whole time? Why are we here? Does Belladar even know we exist? Does it love us for our devotion? Or does it hate us for holding it back? What if its true form is darkness? We've toiled in the light for years. What good has it done? We die, picked off in the shadows one by one. Perhaps we should listen to what Belladar is trying to tell us. There's comfort in the shadows. I'm tired, Tabitha. I know, uh, I know what this means. I know we will end up hurting our own, hurting you. I'm not sorry. Ooh, god damn. Leaving that to the last page? God damn. Candle, right! Ugh. Um, the polearm has faint sigils carved into the haft. They've been torn and changed, forming new shapes. They pulse with dark energy. I have found clues. I shall bring them to you. Mm -hmm. My faith kindles my hope. A cave. Could they still be nearby? Continuing to corrupt the flame. A lamplighter brings hope. Tell me about Alric. Alric was one of us, a lamplighter. For years he worked with us to keep the Dawn Towers lit and the people of Hallowfall safe. We all trusted him. He'd fought with us. We'd saved people from the darkness together. Then he betrayed the Arathi and everything the Light Lampers stand for. He ambushed my friend and Dari and leaders of the Order of the Night and leads the Order of the Night, who caused the breach here and all these deaths. I'm still not sure. Was he ever good? Did he plan that from the start? I don't know any anyone more terrible. No one even comes close. Oof. Don't give in to fear. So they killed Keltha too. We'll make sure he gets a proper funeral. The Order of the Night will pay for this. We sealed off Gloomcrag, the nearby cave, years ago. They might have dug their way in so they could target this Dawn Tower. How long have they been planning this? How long has the Order of the Night been among our ranks? In my heart, there is fire. When I reached for the flame, I felt the overwhelming helpless, hopelessness and despair that had been poured into it. It pains me, but my light alone is not enough to banish these shadows. I am a paladin! And so we take a more direct path. If the remaining cultists have withdrawn to the gloom cragged bower, their combined power must be what's keeping the flame dark. We must stop them before this darkness spreads. I literally, look at me consecrate. Look at this, look at all this light I have. Look at it. Look, look at these armaments. What are those things? They hardly seem real. The trick of the oh shadow. boy. I will deal with them. You all go ahead. Go where? Where are we going? What's this? Wait. Hold, please. Oh, so it's not inside the tower, it's below the tower. In here. Do you know what would have been cool? Which is what I was thinking would happen. Was that the bottom of the tower has a secret entrance into this cave. That's what I was waiting f to be revealed. Like, go go downstairs and look around. Oh my god. Look at this, you know? It's too far away. That's crazy. Harbinger promised. Oh, wow. Hello? 
So angry. No wonder they're all one with the shadow. Who's that? I'm gonna go find out. Quickly, friend. Alric is nowhere to be found. But these traitors are wielding powerful darkness up ahead. I will see you through the shadow. They made their choice. Strong. Good work, but before we can leave, there's something else. Down this way are some powerful priests. I think they're summoning something, something big. No doubt to strike at us, uh, strike at us above and drive us from the tower itself. It will be dangerous, but we must stop them. If we stop that ritual, I should be able to cleanse the flame. Okay, let's go. Come on, buddy. Roars in rage, swinging his sword in with fervor with multiple swings. <laughs> the darkness will take us today. Oh, Anduin. He's a warrior now. <laughs> Everyone's like, is he a paladin? He has a sword. And it's like, he's a warrior right now. He's just, he's working purely off rage. Because he ain't got no light left. <laughs> when he finds his light again, maybe he'll become a paladin instead of a priest. <laughs> Anguishing nightmare. Faerun frowns. We owe our service I've never seen people. shadows this deep, this vicious. It almost feels like they're reaching for us. We can't stay we here. Lost in darkness. More shadows. We're trapped in here, aren't we? No, we're not. I'm a paladin. We're not giving up here. I'm a paladin. We got this. I'm a paladin with a mining hat on, but I'm a paladin nonetheless. We can do this if we stick together. Yeah, come, come. Come, 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 come. Why are you walking, Faerun? Let's go. <sighs> Why are you so slow? Please hurry up, Faerun. What if you failed your people? You think I've never failed? That's dark. I've never made mistakes. I was never even supposed to be in Halafon. I stowed away to escape a family that only ever saw me as a failure. Was it a mistake? I lost an eye and an arm for it. Does that make me unworthy of the light? Mm. I regret nothing. I keep fighting because in the darkness, it's all we can do. Oh, that's right. She just has her shield like attached to her, what's left of her arm, right? Damn, it's so badass. Mm. 
don't understand. I've hurt people. I was controlled by darkness, but part of me enjoyed it. Enjoyed hurting people? Part of me enjoyed it. I'm no longer being able to agonize over every thought and action. Oh, wow. Having doubt, making mistakes, none of these make you unworthy, Anduin. They light your path forward. Oh, man, that's deep. The entrance. It's gone. There really is no way out. Enough of your illusions, Zalatath. Mm-hmm. Belladoz light has returned. Thank you, Illyria. And let's go, brother. You, you, you want to stay in there? I am on the hunt. I'm glad you're safe. I sent something amiss when those creatures suddenly stopped attacking the tower and disappeared. Belladoz shifted on its own shortly after. That was no simple illusion Zalatath trapped you in. I wonder. Was it was I his intended target? You, me, Anduin, Faerun, perhaps she was happy to ensnare any of us. I do not miss. Do you feel it? Hope? Returning? Thank you for your help, Bestie. The Dawn Tower's flame remains dark, but this time I think we'll be able to restore it. Let's meet at the tower. Don't give in to fear. Valeria, we would have been lost without you. Thank you. I'm glad you're all safe. Let's end this. I find myself continuously, like I keep having to zoom in and out. I wish there was like a max zoom and min zoom button. <laughs> I'm ready. In my heart, there is fire. Let's watch this cutscene. Join me, please. Let's go, my boy. You know the light is not with me. Yes, it is. Let's go. There is no darkness so deep that the light cannot reach us. Just be here with me. Now, breathe. We are the seekers of light. We are the holders of hope. In the very heart of shadow, we are the lamps that guide the way. Oh my god, that would have been so awkward and off-putting. Yes, brother! Holy jumper cables! It was Faerun all along. Oh, that little fucking the rest is just eyebrow calm. twitch and trust oh that little f that just that that thing that happens when it it's just, oh it was it was just half a second but did did y'all see that did you feel that when you saw that little like his eyebrows did little did a little thing that it's just it it's the only way I can describe it is that fleeting feeling of like, I don't know, like when you feel like you need to cry because you're so relieved. Yeah, yeah. It was, it was, it was just momentary, but shit like that is that that them's the details we love. My faith kindles my. Heart. Hey, I can't do that shit. Just saying. Despite everything. Thank you. Thank the light. You all arrived when you did. 
I'm glad we can help each other. A beacon in the dark. Gathering shadows. Spreading the light unlocked. Ooh. I had that feeling in the bathroom the other day. <laughs> every time. Every time. Not the other day. Every time. The relief is unreal. So much darkness. How could it come to this? Does the light give way to darkness so easily? In my heart, we must get to Merelda and let General Steelstrike know that the Order of the Night tried here. What the Order of the Night tried here? Thank the Sacred Flame we stopped them before they could do any worse. Travel to Merelda and meet with General Steelstrike. We carry the flame in we need to return to Merelda. I need to let the general know. Apparently we need to return to Merelda to let the general know what happened here. Is no mere cult. The harbinger they speak of is Zalatath. Mm-hmm. She won't stop. Your people need to be ready. Mm-hmm. I'm guessing we follow. They are flying very slowly. I feel very awkward, like, just being like, all right, see, see you there, guys. I just, okay. Oh, that is so pretty, flying towards the, oh, the star. Oh, boy. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Alric corrupted the oh, they beat me here somehow. Ashes take that man and this harbinger. We are a light in the darkness. We are far from the Empire. You have done us a great service, bestie. I've put the army on high alert for Ulrich. If he moves, we'll know about it. For now, though, I think you deserve a break. The day of darkness. I have to admit, I did not think the first visitors we'd have in Merelda would have been outsiders, but I thought the Empire... Well, never mind. You have been more than helpful to my people, and that deserves recognition. Merelda is the bastion of the Arathian Harrowfall. Take some time to rest. We lose so many to the darkness. We're going on a tour! We grab some food at the inn while we can. One of the general's rules I happily follow. I love how every new main city you go to, they're like, you should find the inn. Excuse me, friend. I have many lucky dudes. You have many lucky dudes all up in my friend, face, mate. Can you order a round of drinks? Oh, that's my job. Yeah, I have to learn where the where the innkeeper is. Yep. Now this one looks on like it. I have a story to tell. Round of drinks. The cats are trained as well as the soldiers are. When one bonds to you, you have a friend for life. Ooh. Do you have a lynx? Oh, no. No, no, no. I am not a cat person. I'm not a cat person. When shadow falls, lamp light At some rise. point, you'll have to try our imperial wine. It's made with grapes from the uh, priory and it's heated with a sacred flame. We only drink it on special occasions, so just drinking it is enough to conjure thoughts of good times. What can you tell me of the Arathi Empire? I was young when we left, but I have some memories. I remember the parades through the city streets. Everyone would be out and cheering as the army walked by. I remember the lynxes in ceremonial armor, resplendent and regal. I remember the park near where I used to live. My parents would take me for walks there and we'd feed the animals. Most of all though, I remember the feeling of belonging. I remember my family. I remember my friends. Be strong, Aww. my friend. Oh. Yeah, they're so cool. Oh, we'll the we'll shadow. get there eventually. Um, Don't give in to fear. This city has much to see. It's been good to sit down and breathe for a bit. Help. What have you learned? Alara scanning people in the inn and exiting the inn. Any one of them could be an Order of the Night member. Any one of them could have the information I need. Yeah, but how are you doing? <laughs> you think this is the first time I've lost friends? I've lived a long time. In the Thousand Years' War, I saw planets burn. I lost my brother to the Orcish Horde in the Second War. I lost my sister to herself. To Rallion and Arator, I haven't spent as much time with as I would like. Dalaran isn't the first time I've lost people. Dalaran wasn't your fault. 
It was my job to stop her. Not only did I fail, but I failed so catastrophically that a city was destroyed. I may not have cursed Dalaran's destruction. I may not have caused Dalaran's destruction, but it happened because of me. Is Varisa safe? She's safe, thank the stars. She moved away from Dalaran a few years ago. I stop by when I am able, but my work keeps me busy. Much as I love my sister, she is the least of the things I need to worry about at the moment. We're here for if you here for you if you need us, Alaria. Thank you. After Zara imprisoned me, I had given up all hope of seeing Azeroth again. Of seeing my son. <gasps> After you rescued us, I got to see both, and now I am deep in the bowels of Azeroth with the very person who saved me from another planet. It would be nice if this ended the same way. <laughs> she cannot hide. Zalatath is using the Order of the Night to serve her whims. I overheard some of the Arathi complaining about a new wave of propaganda that had been up and uh, that had been put up around Merelda. Find what you can and deliver it to General Steelstrike. I'll be there as soon as I can. I need to convince her of the severity of this threat. They won't escape. Propaganda. We need to talk. We need to talk. Uh oh. Uh oh. Of course. I need to see Rain about my prosthetics anyway. Let's meet later. I will always try. Oh, what's on your mind? Anduin looks lost in thought as he stares at his drink. Bestie, you've been so helpful down here as always. How do you do it? Ever since the Shadowlands, I, I'm struggling. That wasn't you. It felt like me. I remember the rage. I remember the hate. I remember the exhilaration, satisfaction even. Were my emotion were they my emotions or his? I don't know, but I felt them. In my nightmares, I still feel them. Maybe Faerun's right. Maybe I need to let it go, but I never understood how. How can one just decide one day to feel better about everything? Maybe it just means to keep moving forward. See, this is why I need to go back to play Shadowlands, but friggin' Chromie won't let me go back and finish friggin' Shadowlands. Because every time I get through one area, I hit level 70 or 60 or whatever, and then Chromie's like, time to go to the new expansion! <laughs> and then fucking rips me through time and space into the next expansion. I never get to finish the bloody story. Have they fixed that yet? Is she still doing that, or do we at least, like, have a choice of of how to live our lives? It's so annoying. It's so, so, so annoying. Anyway, what are your thoughts on the Arathi? Honestly, I'm still reeling. I didn't expect to find that there's an entire empire across the sea when I started on this journey. The, Al the Arathi empire of our world collapsed so long ago and has dwindled down to the smallest remnant now. To find that the Empire continued to flourish across the sea. But still, we are dealing with such a small portion of the Arathi. Are they normally this friendly, or do we need to be worried? We have lost so many. You can technically go back, you just won't get XP. Which is fine, but like just let me just be like, yes, Chromie, I get it, but I'm gonna I'm gonna stay here right now. Like is that cool kind of thing? Like, don't, because it, it literally, like, you can be in the middle of the battlefield the furthest away from your Hearthstone ever, like, on the other side of Shadowlands, and she'll just be like, time to go to the Dragon Isles, and then you're, like, in Valdraken, and you're just like, <sighs> and then you have to do the portal hop and then fly all the way back to whatever quest you were doing. Like, <laughs> and it's just the most awful experience we will find Zalatath. I will not fail again yeah Despite she already told us her story cool find joy. lore um oh there's a treasure somewhere don't know if it's inside it's probably outside yeah I think it's outside Ain't none in here. Actually, what's up here? If we're touring the inn, I want to I wanna see what we're working with over here. Open balcony. Oh, we're dancing. What's up? Yes. We burn 
perfectly together. What happens if I dance with them? Nothing. <laughs> Look at him go! Yes, work it. True selves. Oh, amazing! This sunflower is really pretty. Oh, there's more over here. Windows, cute little garden. So pretty, and more stairs. Oh, a Rathi citizen. Ah, oh, cool. Uh, where are we going? Up here. Oh, we all need to talk, hey? I am on the hunt. Stay a while and listen. Am I supposed to be eavesdropping on this? I don't know if I'm supposed to be here for this. She cannot hide from me. I wish you had heeded my warning and stayed in Dornagar. She is here, Anduin. The Arathi are in danger. We are in danger. Oh, we're I supposed to, to be. See if there were really descendants of the Arathi down here. I'm the king of Stormwind. So many human kingdoms have fallen. I needed I'm to the know king if there of Stormwind. Others. It was still a foolish risk. You're not the only one grappling with the voices in their head. What have you been hearing? Beladar, the Emperor's vision. That prophecy that drew them here. It's the radiant song I'm hearing. You have been hearing the star? Yes. No. Not really. When I saw Belladar for the first time, I had the vision again. It's related somehow. I wish Khadgar were here. He'd know what it all meant. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to... No. No, You're it's right. okay. It's all good. I wish he was here as well. We'll have to find our own answers. Okay. I've gotten a look at the crystals and their key flames. It's not Azerite, but it's close enough that I think they're connected. Then you've realized when Belladar shifted for the first time. The day of darkness. The what up, girl? Sargeras plunged that sword into Azeroth. <gasps> oh. Oh. Oh dear. Oh dear. Ding ding ding. Ding ding ding. Ding ding ding. Ding ding ding. Hello. Oh. Hello, old boy. Nightfall Sanctum Delve. What are they talking about here? Hmm, so you think the Order of the Night has a base near there, and it's filled with treasure? Those shadow-touched fools have littered the area again. We need to do something about this. Correct, we unfortunately cannot muster a force to go after them just yet. They deal in foul magics. You'll find me yeah, it's all good, we got this! Good to see you again. I've run into a mess since we last met. Some Nerubian called Zekvir want the expedition to stop exploring this land. You know what that means. We've got to explore even more. These Order of the Night cultists may have information regarding Zekvir. Let's go to the Nightfall Sanctum and see what we can find out. Travel safe. Yeah, buddy. I'm off to check the Nightfall Sanctum. Let's hope these cultists have some information on this Zekvir threat. Yeah, 100%. I'm going to go over here. Let's see what's up with these prosthetics. A lamplighter brings hope. Eh. Eh. I wish to stay a while and listen. Which way are we gonna? Over over here, maybe. Yeah, there we go. <sighs> if you are lost in darkness. Baron! I was inspired last Belladar Shadow. I designed a new arm prosthetic. I think you'll wear this one. Thank you, Rain. But the shield you made me is all I need. I'm sure your talents would be better spent on other inventions. Hey, it's brother. It's my pleasure to make a new arm you would use, Varen. You told me about the discomfort and how it impacted your mobility. So I was thinking... Rain? No. I have lived with my injuries since <laughs> I was a child. I've learned to do everything from sword fighting to dressing myself with one hand. But what if I figured out the weight balancing? 
You said that was what you didn't like about the first you I made. Then I think some of our veterans who will lose an arm to the Nerubians will be very grateful that you've improved the design. Brain, I've learned to navigate my life without a prosthetic. I don't want to relearn everything, but if you want to improve something of mine, a better shock absorber on the shield would be a blessing of the flame. Those Nerubians are getting bigger, and it puts all that weight on the shoulder. Oh, yeah? mm. 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 That's a tough one. Let me sketch out some ideas and get some measurements. I think that'll be an interesting project. Thanks, Baron. Keep up your work. <laughs> Thanks, Baron. <laughs> it's so cute. Appreciates the new kit upgrades. Someone did a deep dive on plunging that sword into Azeroth, calculating what would have happened. The conclusion was that it would have created a shockwave so massive, all life on Azeroth would be extinct almost instantly. Yo, that, it looks like it would, for sure. Same as like, you know, the dinosaurs going extinct or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Oh, there's mining, mining You're guy. Right to be afraid. I already know the things. Some propaganda. You You're hunting some propaganda, mining guy. Ooh, treasure. Don't give in to fear. Reclaim your power. Yeah. Belladar shifts. Hello, it friend. Are you interested in some tomes? A foul. There is always do, do, hope do, if we choose to look for do, it. Do, 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 do. Keep an eye on the Dawn Towers. Ooh. Some cosmetics. Imperial Steel Company. Our quartermaster. I'm also proud to call her my daughter. Oh. Of course she is. I search each day for a winning strategy. Every time we rotate our reserves through, I make sure to learn their names. Many of them won't be coming back. The least I can do is remember them. Why is your daughter the quartermaster? You suspect nepotism? Understandable. You haven't been here for long. My daughter is, without a doubt, the backbone of the Arathi army. I lead it, but she ensures it actually runs. She has a gift for organization that we desperately need. I have tried to rotate her onto the front lines as part of our reserve rotation, as is only fair. I was overruled by the Priory every time. Found a treasure that gave me a jar of pickles. Oh, I love pickles. Caution is warranted. We are surrounded by dangers. I need to know more about this Zalatath. The darkness comes. Oh, ding-a-ling, 78. Your skills in combat are impressive, Bestie. We are rotating our next round of reserves into active duty, and they need to sharpen their skills. While Alaria fills me in on Zalatath, I would appreciate if you could help with the training. Ah, we must duel. Your general asked me to spar with you. The flame burns for all of us. You carry your torch, you like the city. Oh, we can do more of them at a time. Love that. <laughs> Step into the light. Oh, Alaria was standing right there. From the Black Empire? Flames. One of the old gods? No. Something else. A survivor from the depths of time. Something else. I pray for the flame to show us the way. Thank you. What they learn from you will no doubt save their lives later. We must rely on outsiders to save the Arathi. Oh, hang on. There was something we else are here. Surrounded by dangers. Stay well and listen. Caution is warranted. Walk with me for a bit, outsider. I assume Baron has told you of how we came to this strange land. The Emperor's vision. 
A prophecy of light, battle, and victory. For the Arathi and the Sacred oh. Flame. Cliff. I was newly raised to my position. Being entrusted to seek out an Imperial prophecy was a great honor. If only I could Our walk. <laughs> Armada braved the storming sea and its impassable tempest. If only I could remember the button. Was sure to scuttle every airship. Instead, there was a radiant flash. But I can't. The Emperor's vision, exactly as he had foreseen. The light transported us beneath the surface of Azeroth. But still under the light of this star we named Belladon. So many died as the Armada crashed into the cliffs. We thought the eternal flame of Erethor snuffed out that day. Just walk backwards. <laughs> then, as we labored to rescue this stowaway child, Farron, we discovered that she had preserved embers of the flame at risk to her own life. Brave fool. Yet I'm eternally grateful that she held on to that symbol of hope. Don't tell her I said that. <laughs> Ooh, don't tell her I said that. Later, there was a great rumble. We thought Good night, Sai. Si. collapse. It was the day of darkness. Ah. The of shifted to shadow. The day of darkness. We had put down roots by then. My soldiers left to make homes for themselves. They started families. Flames, help me. There are children now. I've had too many years of defending against the monsters that go bump in the night. Great Chiron and their lamplighters guided us through the darkness. But like Farron, they mistake saving for safeguarding. My people are brave and strong, but they are not all flame blessed heroes. There is people, man. Exactly how many soldiers we lose to the dark. If we play it safe, we might survive long enough for me to put my grandchildren on the front line. I welcome Damn. you, outsider. I hope your people's arrival and the Earthen's reunification means better days for Meraldar. But I fear we have just made ourselves a bigger target for the dark. I would safeguard my people. The day of darkness. I still need more time with Elaria to learn about Zalata. What I have learned is very worrying. Faerun sent word that she was going to the orphanage and asked you to meet her there. She often entertains the children while she's in Merelda. I don't doubt she would appreciate you doing the same. We Play with three orphans. Faerun's at the orphanage. She was the first child to call it <laughs> She visits whenever she can. Yeah, thanks, Rune. Appreciate. They're running away. How am I supposed to play with them when they're running away? We're playing hide and seek. One of us is hiding and you need to find them. Do you want to play? I guess. Oh my god, did I just spank that child? I swear I just spanked that child. That was really awkward. Oh my god. When the starships get to shelter. Oh my god. <laughs> so awkward. Um Okay, I feel like this is telling me where someone's hiding. Wait, am I seeking or hiding? He's just sitting there. Wow, you're pretty good at hide and seek. <laughs> He's literally just sitting in the open upstairs. I like it when the stars We're looking for a big grown-up to pretend to be a monster. Can we slay you? Know what to do during curfew. Roar. Not scared of you. Take that. Run from us. Flee. Uh. That was lots of fun, bestie. I'm guessing this is a world quest to do more of that. Because there's an achievement to do all of them. So yay for us. We are a light in the darkness. 
Welcome to our orphanage. When we arrived, I was the only child. They founded this for me. I'm not quite sure how uh, Siegfried put up with me. I was quite rambunctious. I love coming here when I'm in town. Despite everything, the kids are so bright and happy. They are our future and we fight for them. Be strong. I love coming here when I visit Merelda. The kids are always kids always bring a smile to my face and I hope to I hope I do to them as well. After everything they've been through, they deserve happiness. Oh no. That's a big ding dong. We cannot hide from evil. A beacon in the dark. The, those bell means that Meryl dies under attack. Let's go to the gates and find out what's going on. Despite everything. Meryl dies under attack. Children, stay inside. Oh, she gone. I didn't mean to fly all the way up here, but my thing is broken. Okay, the here we go. Strike our veneration grounds during Belladar's light. How? Look, General, Darkfire. This is our experience. This? Oh boy. We carry the flame into the unknown. This land was not what we expected. Light of the flame. The Cobus have never attacked in such numbers before. We need to push them back, and we need to stop whatever they are doing to the eternal flame we, lose so we need to take the veneration grounds back from the cobus push them back and pave a bloody path through them we need to stop whatever is happening at the eternal flame if they manage to corrupt it like i like they did at the tower i don't want to imagine what will happen is <laughs> kill 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 i can sense three beacons of the void up ahead all funneling their power to one massive font of darkness you need to kill them with them dead i can bring down the shield Back the oh boy. Make them regret ever stepping onto our hallowed lands. Oh boy. I'm guessing we can just go ahead and bonk heads. Oh, there's a roar. Get him, kill him, slap him. Give me that loot. I think maybe it'd be worth like having like whatever character I'm doing world quests on, I'm gonna do that on um on war mode. I mean not world quests, um side quests. Uh, do that on war mode, but then also keep one character not in war mode so that if there's something that I need to collect, that would like be annoying getting ganked all the time or whatever. Like, there's some stuff, or like pet battling, or like collecting pets, or stuff like that. Um, yeah, we'll see. Ah, uh, these guys. Got it. I'm on it. Oh, fine. Oh yeah, I just hit 78. Stuff is gonna scale like poo poo now. forgot about that. I feel like 78 is like the tilting point where they've expected you've at least tried to do a delve or a dungeon or something by that point, but I haven't because I'm I'm just following the quests and if the quests don't make me do the dungeons, I, I'm not doing no dungeons. I did like the first one, like the first delve and the first dungeon. I don't think they're necessarily part of the campaign. But I just happened to... Oh, actually, the first dungeon, I think, was part of the campaign. And the Arathi through their fear. Oh, boy. Potentially a bad idea. No regrets. Is this going to be my first death of the expansion? We'll see. Die. 
darkness. Yeah, very, very fun. Um, and yeah, I still have to add all my alts to the uh, to the guild, but I haven't played them yet. I'm kind of doing other stuff on them. They're not really in the current expansion at the moment. I also never had a proper lunch, so gotta gotta do some of that. Yeah, I'll prepare the chicken in the morning, he said. He said. Delicious. Draw strength from the darkness. So do I. Mm-hmm. What have you learned? Grey will not escape. We've lost the eternal flame. Light of the Empire, we've lost everything. Our holy mission takes a toll. Bellada has turned to shadow. We must retreat back to Merelda. I no, we need to destroy Elric first. Take him down, then we retreat. The darkness comes. We are prepared. He reminds me of Dakan Drathir. Let, let us hope he stays dead. Elric thinks the shadows will save him. He should see what true power looks like. Uh. Oh my. I'm out of water too, so it's a bit timely. Now, go for the kill. Okay, I'm going. Anyone wanna help me with this guy? Anybody? Anyone oh. Oh, hold on. Hold hold please. Everyone's busy. That's awkward. Please exit the darkness on the ground, thank you. Smack that man's... She's taken an interest in, you. in me? I, I ain't nothing. I'm I'm a I'm chilling. I'm a paladin. I'm just doing my thing. You don't you don't need me. T hee, now you gonna learn. Rathi be in league with such monsters. The sacred flame is lost. Fall back! No. We cannot keep retreating from the darkness. Our fear has overshadowed our faith. Beladar may have guided us, but it is not what will save us. Stand with me against the shadow. Show this harbinger the true strength of the Arathi. Yeah! If you fall against the darkness, what will we do then? It's what we always say, General. The light will return. Even if someone else carries the torch. We are the seekers of light. We are the holders of hope in the very heart That's of right. shadow. Together, we 
guide the way. She is the prophet! The prophet has spoken! She brings light! Oh, wait! I must ensure my people survive. May the light bless Faerun. I thought the eternal flame lost. I thought this was the end of hope and uh, the death of our people. The day of darkness changed. The veneration grounds have been desecrated. It's beauty marred. It's going to take a bigger effort, but I would appreciate anything you can do to clean up our grounds. We are surrounded by dangers. My faith kindles By the flame, that was close. I'm glad it worked. I mean, of course it worked. I knew it would work. Don't tell the general I said that. Don't give in to fear. That was too close. This attack took a toll on all of us. We have many injured and many shaken. Can you check in with people, see how they're doing? We carry the I will do that next time. 